Hey, Vandal community, how's it going? So, much to my surprise today, I got a package in the mail. And it says it is from JT, and it is from Sparks, Nevada. Now, the only JT I know is from JT's Record Room, who has an awesome channel, an amazing collection. The thing about JT's videos is I'm always like, I always go into his videos knowing, okay, you're going to be super jealous because he's going to show you some incredible records that somehow he manages to find over on the west side of the United States. An incredible cassette collection. Some of my favorite videos were the ones where he showed all these cassette tapes that he has in his garage that are in mint condition and cassettes I never even knew existed. So definitely check JT out. Not only does he have an incredible music collection, but the history, uh, the things that he, the people he knows, the things he's experienced, um, just have blown my mind over this past year or so. Um, some of the comments he's left about certain characters and celebrities that he knows, run-ins that he's had with, I think, like Dennis Hopper. I mean, it's just incredible. I would love to get together with him sometime and just hear him tell his stories because uh, my jaw, I always have to pick it up off the floor um, after I watch a video or hear him talk about some of these incredible stories that he's had. But nonetheless... Um, he sent me something, which is very kind of you. Um, I really appreciate it. Anytime anybody sends me something, it is very, um, very much appreciated. So I've already cut this, but I haven't looked inside. So I'm going to open it up and see. Um, there is a uh, note here. Um, hey, Jeff, hope you had a nice Father's Day. have wanted to send you something for a long time and fun to share an important album to me. Um, the Man Who Sold the World, 1970, equally great are Hunky Dory, 1971, and Ziggy Stardust, 1972. It's a long note, so I'm not going to read it all here, but check that out. Look at that awesome David Bowie. And speaking of David Bowie, I just saw the Moon Age Daydream trailer. Um, that looks awesome. Looks like it's going to be a documentary interwoven with maybe some um, recreations, but it looks fantastic, especially if you're a David Bowie fan. You definitely have to check that out. But I am going to um, read this in its entirety um, after I uh, do this video, but I want to be able to show everybody what he sent me. So um, look at this. The Man Who Sold the World. Wow, this is fantastic. Uh, it has the tracks, The Width of a Circle, All the Mad Men, Black Country Rock, After All, Running Gun Blue, Savior Machine, She Shook Me Cold, The Man Who Sold the World, which, of course, Nirvana covered famously on their Unplugged album, and then The Superman. Uh, this is awesome. I uh, can't wait to spin this. Uh, thank you, JT. JT has impeccable taste in music. And, oh my God, this is one of my grails. Talking Heads Naked, the only Talking Heads album I didn't have. And John was so cool to send this. I can't even believe it. In fact, I saw this on um, JC, uh, Josh from Flipside Vinyl. He had this on his like little wall of vinyl behind him. I'm like... One of these days, I'm going to need to pick that album up. Thank you, uh, JT. I really appreciate it. That is awesome. Uh, again, JT is one of the kindest, uh, most enigmatic members of the VC. Um, so, I yeah, I just love this. Um, and very cool. Thank you very much. And... Uh, Hope you all are doing well and have a great day.